That is, uh, that's much more pixel than I, than I thought. Much less pixel than I thought, I guess, is probably a better way to put it. That is, there's, there were at least a couple <laughs> there. Two or three, I would say. Uh, I think the screen needs... Always weird with these, like, old games. Nothing's ever just in the same spot. Everything's always... Oh, that's weird, too. It's like... Okay. Like, not quite cool. Anyways. No, <laughs> that's just nostalgic cataracts, yeah. <laughs> that's... 100%. Alright, new game, dude. Vibration on's fine. The fuzz. That's a that's a weird selection graphic, you know? Just being fuzzy around whatever you're selecting. Those people on the boat are made up of at least six pixels. One for each arm, one for their head, uh, two for their body, one for their legs. Oh god, I'm spilling all down myself. As long as I don't die on my drink today, I'll be happy enough. Surprisingly, I don't remember this intro at all from when I was playing on the PS3 remaster. I remember the kid. There. Doesn't he have, like, his sick sister or something in the boat? Yeah, there she is. Is he a prisoner? Is that what it is? Ooh, damn. Thank you for feeding Bo. the sword? Can't move. Oh, you were telling the other dude to get the sword. I thought you were telling me to get the sword. I'm kind of stuck, my guy. Okay. Magic sword is magic. Understood. much well. I like the old elevators. Just in general. I like old elevators. They're neat. Like, they always seem to follow the same basic design of those giant-ass gears just on the sides. But what's spinning the gears, you know? That's pretty sick. That you can get the sword in uh, Shadow of the Colossus. Are the games connected in some way? Because, like, I feel like they're connected in some way, but I can never remember by doing time trials. Okay, so the village sacrifices kids. I'm assuming to appease some sort of god or something. Very vague, yes, okay. I like it. I like it. I mean, I didn't think they were, like, directly connected anyways. Just, like, same universe or uh, maybe even same general area. Same religious cult. I don't know. <laughs> that sort of thing. I didn't expect, like, Shadow of the Colossus to be a sequel or vice versa. All of these pods full of sacrifice children. Why don't I remember this at all? Several years before you go, okay. <laughs> well, that was lucky.
god just take a liking to us or is that just just much luck such a wow I think you're meant to be walking around right now, my guy. How do I not remember this at all? The PS3 version does start the same way, right? <laughs> like, I don't, I don't think I'm crazy. So we can do like a shoulder thing. Jump with triangle. Circle. Walk. And yell. And zoom the camera in a very inconvenient way. And also kind of move the camera around. Are we... I feel like we're some sort of entity watching this kid. I guess it's just the way the camera, like, controls. And then just always, like, focuses back on him and whatnot. We just feel like... It doesn't feel like a, like a fixed camera angle game. It feels more like a god game, you know? And we're just watching a, a kid do something. I'm ladders, I assume yes, yeah. Does, yeah. I, why don't I remember this at all then? <laughs> I, I remember the kid, and I remember. I remember, like, a. a I presume girl. Uh, I think it was a sister or something. But I don't remember this at all. Interesting jump. Lover, you just like jump on it. Circle, aha, circle to interact. Going to assume there's probably fall damage, yeah. Maybe not. Very least, that wasn't far enough to to take it. Climb the chain. And climb the chain. Can we swing on the chain? Oh, shit. And, okay. Good to know. I don't know if that's something we need to do right now, but good to know that we can. Can we spin around on the chain? We just hold circle and he swings himself. It would appear so. Yes, okay. Okay, okay. Because as soon as we let go, he stops. Oh, this wasn't even where we wanted to go, was it? No, we want to go up higher. God. Oh, thank God, dude. <laughs> thought for sure we were going to miss the chain. Thank goodness this kid didn't skip arm day. Wait, where are we going? If not here. Out the window?
There seems to be like set amounts that he goes up or down the chain. Oh god, okay. Well, we just jumped that high. We should be able to, yeah. <laughs> we die? No, we're good. Okay. <laughs> just jumped into the void, you know? Why not? So we can't open those things without the magic sword. I don't believe. Ladder. Here. Seems to go up and around. There was another ladder over here, though. Where does... Oh, same thing. Just different side of the room. Okay. This one's closer now, so... I like the lighting, though. I'll give them that, man. For as low resolution as the game is, the lighting's very nice. For a PS2 game. Okay, this didn't go up nearly as high as I thought it did. This is the other side? The other side does, actually. This is a ladder, though. Yeah, like the real-time shadows and stuff. Not bad. Not bad. Besides everything being very gray, it's not bad, like, uh, polygon-wise or anything. The, the environment. There you go. Environmentally, it, it looks pretty decent. tempted to try and figure out if there's fall damage or not <laughs> jumping off this ledge but I'm, I'm assuming there is especially at like this kind of height ain't again I like that it automatically spun us around when we needed to be here. When we got to the top. Andy. Wonder if the dead zone's a little messed up on my controller. It seems like if we run in a specific angle, we just kind of start walking a little bit. <laughs> But I doubt this game uh, has dead zone settings. Bro, I don't know if she's real. She looks kind of like a shadow. There's an open window right here. When all else fails, we just yeet ourselves from windows. Japanese Rapunzel. Her hair long enough to be a Rapunzel, though? Is there anything up here? Are there, like... Is... I know this is, this is mostly, like, a puzzle platform, right? Are there any, like, secret items or anything we should be looking for at any point? I mean, not that this is going to be our full playthrough, so I guess it doesn't really matter right now, but... I'm just curious. I know so little about the game. Oh, there we go. Quicker way down that doesn't involve me <laughs> probably jumping to my death. Not really, no, okay. It didn't feel like the type of game there would be, or that would have, like, you know, secret items, chests, whatever. I mean, I don't believe Shadow of the Colossus really is either. It's just whenever I saw this little area here, it just looked perfect for that sort of thing. 
for, you know, like an early game potion or something, so I wasn't sure. While the camera's really awkward, and the thing with me kind of walking, when I press a specific direction, it actually feels like it handles a little better than Shadow of the Colossus. Maybe it's the smoother frame rate? Jumping faster than running. Have to make sure not to jump off the freaking staircase here. Because of the little like stumble animation when he lands, I don't think it is. But you definitely feel like you pick up some momentum whenever you, whenever you jump. Um, oh, okay, that's what this ladder's for. And probably, like, jump on top of the cage. This might be the girl I remembered. Maybe. I'm not positive of that, but... You got a stick! A flaming stick! Be honest i thought he was wearing a helmet i didn't realize those were like a bandage and actual horns the stick how do we pick up so cool. we're shadow creature it's shadow creature with fire stick poke it x square square okay. uh can she like get herself out Oh. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay. Is it because our stick went out? I'm guessing we need the fire. The, the, the stick fire. Skippable cutscenes? What? Okay, um... How do I... Re How do I relight the stick? Am I walking too fast? Do I need to, like, walk slowly with the stick? Is it... Is it... Is it the air? Oh, shit. Before I jumped on here, I actually wanted to check and see... There was any more like fire on the ground I could use anywhere, but I don't think there is. Pick up the stick. Damn you. Okay. Walking. Walking. Shit, it still went out, dude. Now it must be a timed thing then.
Yeah, because we can't hit the dude with the stick. The stick always seems to go out after a moment. Gotta become one with the stick, of course. Why didn't I think of that? <laughs> Thank God for kippable, kippable cut peens. Skippable cutscenes. Otherwise, I would be fucked. No, run! Okay. Wait, what? Why did we just look at it and not do anything? Can I help her? I don't know what to do! Oh, wait. Did I start to do something there? I'm so, I'm so confused. Should I read the manual? Just the... <laughs> I don't fucking know. Ah! Okay. Option. E config. Jump, attack, action, release, hold hands. Huh? Maybe R1 then. Uh, not end game. Yes, there we go. R1 to hold hands. That's all we need to do. Was she evil all along? What are the chance of that? Will she climb? Climb! <laughs> Beat the shadow monster. Okay, good. Now climb. Come up. Come up. Okay, good. She's following. <laughs> Fucking companion games, man. I have no idea if this is where we need to be taking her, but I don't know where else to take her. Okay, looks like I need to drag her. She's super slow. Come on. I mean, the only other place I could think are the doors down bottom there but we don't have the magic sword so i don't think we're gonna be able to get through them but wasn't there like a sealed door or something up here where we pulled the switch at maybe now it'll be open or i'm just wasting my time that's that's personally reasonable to think as well can you climb things like i can No. Okay. That looks like... That looks like a door, though, does it not? Uh, maybe... No. So maybe if we put her back in the cage, then she could ride the cage up like an elevator. But even if she did that, can she jump that far? I don't know. That might not work. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay, that was close. Shit, not this one. That... Next one. But yeah, this is definitely a door.
That didn't do anything, though. This does look like a gate. That does appear to be connected to the chain. Or to the gate, like... There's some sort of crane thing coming off of it. Collectors start doing anything. I mean, she's doing something now that we're yelling at her. But is she just gonna, like, go to the bottom and get herself killed? Or... Is she actually gonna do something useful? Like, maybe go back in her cage. Is she going down the ladder, or what does she do? I wish we could see her, even just a little bit. Yeah, I'm thinking this isn't the right thing to do. <laughs> no better time than now! <laughs> okay, that worked. This isn't something we can pull right yet, no. Hi. Uh, hand? Come with me. Maybe we should have tried the doors downstairs. First. Can I jump while holding your hand? Ooh, okay. If we get too far away, you let go, though. I mean, that makes sense. So she doesn't, uh, I'm assuming she doesn't jump and she doesn't climb anything but ladders. You know, the basics. Are there more shadow creatures around here? Or are we good now? Yeah, I mean, she seems to be struggling climbing just that ladder. Aha! She has magic too! I should have tried that first, man. <laughs> just because of how much closer it is. Oh, well. Live and learn all that. You come up this short gap? Yeah, okay. Not gap, but ledge. Whatever. You come up this slightly larger ledge. Can I, like, help you up it? Huh. Ah, there we go. That's what I was trying to do the first time, but then I, like, jumped down for some reason. Chair? There's something about the chair? Why is the chair glowing? You take a rest? Oh, that's how we save! That's smart. Uh, what? The hell of a save menu, man. <laughs> this looks great. It is a CD game, which... a CD game. I mean, it looks pretty decent, I gotta say, I guess. Sorry, I'm a little, I'm a little biased against PS2 CD. Generally not the best of games. Age old bridge. Forgot about save couch? I didn't even know about save couch. But, I mean, that's got to be one of my favorite ways to save, you know. The only thing better than that is just taking a nap to save. IRL. <laughs> oh, no! Okay, so if we weren't holding her hand, I wonder if she would have just died there. Also, how's this bridge still standing? Without that connection in the middle, I'd expect the whole thing to just rumble. But I guess magic.
when all else fails, man. It's all about magic. Now this door... That looked very similar to the other door that was shut, but I'm thinking maybe opening the one would open the other. But no, it looks like it just opens it, so... We smash. Uh, I don't know, but we can pick up. Oh no! Get back up here! Why? Where are you going? Stay here. Put this down. Beat these shadows with a bat. Oh, the shadows learned how to dodge now, huh? This is my girl. I claimed her. You can't have her. Oh, they caught. Oh, no! I heard her. He made noise. Where'd she go? Oh, God, dude. This is how we lose. Where? Seriously, where? Oh, there she is. Hi. Okay. We just run away from them? Jeez. <laughs> Fuck those things, man. <laughs> I don't even need to be in there. I don't think. Uh, I take it back. Maybe I do. Can I go in alone? Will it work? If I go in here alone, does she stay out there? It does, but the door also stays open. Interesting. Oh, okay. She didn't stay out there forever. How do we hit these little bastards? Okay. Did we just ignore them? Did we just ignore them? Nothing down here. Those ones seem to be too big to pick up, but we also can't break them. What's this do? We push it together? Oh no, I can tell her to climb on stuff though. Interesting, okay. Oh, I can push stuff, it's circle. sick. Entire staircases appearing out of nowhere. Give hand. Thank you. Should have been paying attention to the windows. Were there any to climb out? I like how, like... We can't really understand what he's saying, except for like in cutscenes when there's subtitles, of course. And she can't understand us, we can't understand him. There's a lot of mystery, you know? And I love the way, as I presume this is more or less a tutorial section, but I love the way that never once did it pop up and tell me to do something, <laughs> you know? Like it never told me, press square to pick this thing up, press X to do that thing or whatever. It just gives you a chance to to figure it out. <laughs> and I love that. Real big fan. <laughs> yeah, in 2001, better tutorials than, <laughs> than what we have now. The only thing I would say that they could have done a little bit better for the early game, but hopefully it's something they would phase out, is like whenever... Maybe I missed it, but they could have showed her, like, using a little bit of that sparky magic or something at some point to know to do those doors down at the bottom. And every once in a while, since the camera can, like, just look all over the place, it could just kind of, like, point in a direction, like, give a subtle nod. Or if she knows anything about this area, I don't know the lore for that, but she could just kind of, like, point and say something that we don't understand, that sort of thing, to give us a little hint on where to go. But I'm perfectly fine with, like, 
no no text pop-ups telling us do this do that whatever like I don't need that shit I don't want that shit speaking of though what the hell do we do there doesn't seem to be anything we can do here we can't like fit out these windows or no we can stumble over them though What's... Oh, this is an area. Okay. But can she... Come down here? I think we'll be fine, but... No, don't go away. Come here. Uh, okay, hold on. I do know we can do... Like, if I go up against this ledge and then R1... Okay, we can't tell her to go on this ledge. Oh, shit. <laughs> I didn't mean to jump like that. My bad. Are you willing to come down here? No. Okay, that's, that's fair. I didn't figure she would... Add a text prompts into Shadow of the Colossus story, so I think they were a minority. <laughs> That's too bad, you know? I mean, a lot of game companies went through that sort of thing, though, you know what I mean? Because, like, you look at Legend of Zelda, and uh, then look at pretty much any modern, mid mid modern Zelda game, like how vastly different the tutorials and were that and whatnot were, you know? Like, Legend of Zelda was very open, figure-it-out type thing. Maybe even a bit too much. And then, as time went on, they just tutorial-heavy. Like, just no sense of exploration at all. Just go do this thing. We'll walk you through it every step of the way. Before finally return to form with, like, Breath of the Wild and whatnot. Yeah, just call the Nintendo Hotline. They'll tell you what to do for the low, low price of $5 a minute. I don't actually remember what the price was, but... I feel it was pricey. Or, buy the Nintendo Magazine. If you're lucky, that month they'll be doing a walkthrough for whatever game you're playing. Okay. Obvious chain is obvious, but anything else down here? But she can't climb chains either. No, okay, well, let's go up the chain and figure out what's there. I thought that was like a door or something. No, that's just a fallen piece of rubble. Okay. Get off the column, please. Jump! Up, up there? No, okay. Rotate. Wink. Is it realistic in where like the longer the chain, the farther you can... Kind of looks like it, honestly. No! Okay, hold on. Can I quickly push this down? Get away from my white lady. <laughs> my white shadow lady. Is she alive? I feel like she's not alive. Oh, God. Ah, no. Let me up. Let me up, please. Get off her! <laughs> Damn it, dude. Can I get magic sword? No. Stay away. I really wish we could light this thing on fire. I feel like fire would be good to fight shadow beasts. Glad there's no friendly fire, man. Imagine if we just accidentally beat the shit out of her with a stick. Like, you'd never trust us again. All this work we've put into building up trust with each other and stuff, down the drain. One accidental hit with the stick. More of them? Or is it just never-ending spawn? It might just be a never-ending spawn. Might just have to juggle, like, 
pushing that block under the chain and keeping her safe. That thing dead? That one's dead. Okay. Maybe stay away from the black goo ball. Okay, no, it, it stopped. Oh, go too far. Okay, well, doesn't seem to do stopping halfway. Can we pull it? Can pull it. Tiny little press. Yeah, okay, it just... It moves in section. Now can she climb up? Guessing that's a no. What does the block do for it? Now that she's safe, we can probably explore a little bit. Er, another block or something? A broken ladder. I'm not going to be able to jump that height yet, no. Maybe if we had saved that block, maybe we could have used it. It doesn't feel right leaving her this far behind, though. Which makes me wonder if this is the right move or if we're missing something. I feel more as if we're missing something. Stairs down to nowhere. Okay. Ladder then. Just an overview. Hmm. Okay, yeah, we're definitely missing something. What's this break in the. I like. When I press that one specific direction, oh, those are stairs down too. This just takes us back to where we came? No. Okay, well there she is. The fact that it, like, loops back on itself makes me feel a little bit better that maybe we're not completely doing the wrong thing. But I'm not particularly confident in that either. I, I doubt she can hear us, dude. Probably not worth calling for. Dude. I... Okay, there's another save couch. There's a safe couch. We probably need to get her up here. And since we can't jump that high, and we are on some train tracks, maybe there's some sort of, like, mine cart or something that's going to come through here, or we have to send down here. But it would appear as though we still need to figure out how to get her to come with us. That would have been another way to the train tracks here. Platform. Well, here's the cart that I was looking for. Oh. Oh, shit. We're dead. Yup. <laughs> That's... That's fair. Damn it, dude. Fix this back a little farther than I was hoping. Well, we know what to 
do kind of more or less. Oh, interesting that the things don't respawn. That's a time saver. Or maybe it's just because she hasn't walked in the room yet, though. Or that the entire world is moving beneath that burden. It just did not give a fuck. Yeah, there we go. Now that she's in here, they angry again. We just like run. Those, there's no reason we can't. Unless they just follow forever. Well, no, once we load into a new zone, we should be fine. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, there was nothing to do in here. Oh, that's right. That's right. That's right. Okay. You just go down here. Pull the lever. That'll let her down to here. But then what? Can't interact with the boulders in any way. That's that spot that it looked like the, the thing was to go on. The block, but it didn't actually do anything. I don't think. Yeah, there doesn't appear to be anything else here. Is it possible that by sending the block down here we fucked up? There was that one ladder that maybe we could push the block to. And get up? Maybe? I'm assuming her coming down here is what triggers the shadow people. I'd rather deal with them now than later, though. I understand you were kept in that cage for God knows how long, but come on, you gotta know it's stay away from the shadow pit. Nothing good's gonna come from the Shadow Pit, dude. Dead. Oh, shit. Ow. He's not dead. Up. Nope. Leave her alone. Sorry, I'm just swinging at nothing right now. There you go, Noodle. That one's pretty cute. Dead shadow. And pick on him. Back up we go. And we swing. Only thing is, like, I feel like pulling this. Oh yeah, pulling this through the door probably is impossible. Even now that I look at it, that door's like, yeah, okay, got a little lip on it. So it's got to be bring it down here, right? Because there's no nowhere else yet. Push down. Section? 
with help. I don't think I'd be able to get her up there. Can I drag her up? No. Can, okay. So you stay here. Okay, we made it. Like... No, don't tell her to go away. I wanted to help her up. Hmm, okay. Check this way, right? It's just a cliff? Or no? Fall. Same thing. It looks like we need to figure out how to get to that ladder. Cars are pointless. And we can do there. This is just showing us the future for some reason. Interesting looking. Uh, okay, over here. There is one more little area right here I didn't go to, right? That's oh, a save couch. Yeah, see, it's like, if there's a save couch here, then I have to believe we're able to get her up here somehow. Which makes me believe that we can use that block to do something. Okay, so there is fall damage, even whenever you're just jumping to places you've been to before. Good to know. Good to know. This is all learning experience for whenever we finally, like, actually play through the game. Play through the game, that's all. Shit. Uh, let go of her hand, so hopefully she stays there for a second. Good. I'm just run away from these fools. Bird really just does not give a shit, dude. I don't get the spiders. I mean, the spiders might have, like, knocked me down. Well, that's a possibility. Are you attacking me because you couldn't get her? I'm glad the save points are pretty pretty fair. Or checkpoints, whatever. At least so far. But like I feel like we're super close to another one. I just don't know how to I just don't know how to do it. I'm missing something. I feel like it should be possible to get her on the train. by the stairs. Doesn't make sense. Yeah, even if we can press, push the block up here, 
this wall here solid. That's not gonna work. Oh, nope. Probably climb up a little bit higher before we start swinging, my guy. Like Billy Swing. <laughs> I don't I don't think that's gonna help in any way. The fact that this block does not line up with this obvious block shaped spot here really bothers me. Like either side of the chain. Pretty sure I've tried it before, but if I call her while I'm here, does it do anything? Yeah, it just kind of centers the camera on her. I guess we can quickly do. The thing with the thing. See if that does anything with the, um... The cart. The mine cart. That's the only other thing I see that, like, we can potentially interact with. Rude. Oh, double rude, dude. Oh, could you not, like, pathfind to her? Oh, man. You guys have trouble with stairs. Oh, well, she ran into the danger zone now. No, you don't, you bastard. Nope, not poof. Round two. Dead? Not dead. Now dead. Dead. Wait, that time she climbed right up on it like it was nothing. Not on the chain, though. She still won't do chains. Tell her to jump. See, you jump. Go like this to the chain. She, she does not understand that. Okay. Minecart then. Ah! Telling her we'll be back, you know? We didn't forget about her, that's all. I wonder why he was born with the uh, horns on his head. There's like lore to that. Yeah, we can yell to her, but like that's not gonna not gonna do anything though, right?
Please don't fall again. I just like press circle from here, no? There we go. Oh. oh shit, okay. Man, I'm glad I figured that out quick. That could have been bad. We can move this thing at will. We can't like dump it or anything though, right? Yeah, no. I mean, it looks like there's something in it. But I guess it doesn't really matter what. Nothing else that'll let us up to here. That doesn't help us with her though. We really meant to leave her behind for that long. We can't save without her, right? Yeah, no. Need her magic to, to nap on the couch or saving. Uh, big jump. Good job. Pipe? I know what to do with pipes. Okay. <laughs> Bruh, first he didn't start moving. I was like, okay, I thought I knew what to do with pipes. Maybe not. That's a big fall. Let's not do that. Ooh, another level? Uh, here. Interesting. Does that do anything for me, though? <laughs> climb up this, can't we? Yes. Oh, God. I don't like the small, small walkway here. I guess that's what the circle button's for. can't swing this thing right now, okay. We, like, unhook this? And just climb it? I guess we wouldn't really want to unhook it with us standing on it anyways. Presumably this is for her, to help her move somewhere. But since we still don't have her up here. Oh no, you bastard. Son of a bitch. That's fine. What the fuck do we do here? This is what I was saying with, I wouldn't mind if the game just gave us little subtle hints with like her pointing at something or the camera panning to a specific spot. Unless, I mean, they've already done that sort of thing and I've just completely missed it, I guess. <laughs> guess that's possible. And there is still this other door. Do we come back? Guess I haven't walked out there and looked at it. Hold on. Oh, damn it. Didn't let me up in time. Up. I just run out here. Is she safe? I'm assuming she teleports to us when we change them. No, she does not. Okay, there's no way either one of us are making that jump. I think she was just grabbed based off of the sound. Yeah. So she isn't safe when we're not with her. Even if we're in a different zone. That's really good to know. I don't need to kill that thing. 
thought I trapped it outside for a second. I was actually kind of excited. If we go into a new zone together, though, safe. That's where we just came from. Nothing down there. Wondering if, like, we should even let her down here until we figure out what the hell to do, but I don't know if I'm ever going to figure it out. get the crate and the crate does blank there's got to be some point to having this crate here there's no way it's not for nothing can't seem to pull her up that doesn't get any lower at any point Nothing else in this room, right? Am I? Might as well have you come down now. You can kill those things and start trying some stuff. Oh shit, that was a big drop, girl. me I miss you we both suck what now oh god get up oh no they got her I didn't realize she was that close I thought she was still on the other side of the room thank god these shadow beasts seem to have like a physical form that we can smack no you don't give me your hand Oh, you bastard. Okay, good. She's already out. Got to get the new one, though, before she gets eaten. You would think she would fucking run away. Something. Okay, that's it. Good. And right, now, not away. See you up here. Can't seem to instruct her to go up there. Oh, keep her up there. Oh, son of a bitch. Look overhand, jump down, stay there. Oh, fuck. Why do I keep... 
Or why am I not my controller fucking up? Keep like half swinging and then just stopping. Maybe I wasn't up high enough. Maybe I was technically hitting the ledge with my feet. Okay. How is it possible for me to help you? No, don't send her away. No, tell her to... Hmm. Can I push her on it? When she's on it, can I push it? I mean, I can, but she didn't seem to like it. Okay, can I push it up the ledge? No way for me to take it out of this room. There's nothing in this room I can seem to interact with. Bros, I think we're stuck. When I first saw this puzzle, I was like, oh, that's going to be easy, man. Just put the fucking block under the chain. All's well with the world. Nope. <laughs> I was fucking wrong. <laughs> What? <laughs> okay. So the answer is something I've tried. <laughs> Apparently. And have just failed at. Okay, you know what? Let's put it right... We just need to help her up this ledge, apparently, because she won't climb chains, which is fine. I didn't think she would climb chains. After, like, the first time we tried. But then we tried to do this, and that didn't fucking work either. Oh, yeah, no, we are hitting our feet on that. Okay, go up again. Yeah, apparently, we need to just... Or why did it not do that before? <laughs> I mean, of course I thought about this. We did this earlier, but I tried it two or three times and it didn't work. So I gave up on it. I was like, oh, that ledge is too high. Nope. It's just jank. That's fine. What game doesn't have some jank to it? All that struggle, though, for nothing. At least I'm not the only person that's ever had problems with it. <laughs> like, instantly found a game FAQ board, er, post. Literally from just ball and chain eco. <laughs> or not ball. <laughs> Fuck, whatever. Uh, box and chain eco. That's all I searched. Found it, like, instantly. Well, we've already solved the next puzzle. I feel like. The next two puzzles, probably. Because one is just the, the mine card, I'm pretty sure. And then the other one would be... Uh, that, that giant box that we had to move. Presumably by moving that, we can get her to the next area or whatever. Can't help but notice one of these looks a lot bigger than the others. Does that just mean he takes more damage or if we get, or like has more health? Or is he legit just like harder to kill? That 
That I don't know. Let's definitely save the game, though. Hopefully we won't have to do that again. It took us 50 minutes. 50 minutes to figure that out. GG us. Uh, not Oopa. Grab hand. Now, though, when we're doing the trolley, we might hit her with it if she's down there. So will she stay up here if we don't bring her down? Hopefully she will. Have to be careful because presumably smacking her with the uh, minecart would be be a bad time for everyone. She's still up there. Really hope she is. Can I, like, get her to ride this thing with me now? He really struggles with ladders, huh? Myself a little bit right there. How is it? Can we hit that? Like, is it possible to drive through that? Anything bad happen if we hit it? No. Okay, thank God. And we should be able to just help her up. Yes. Save point numero dos. Trace, actually, whatever. Three? The third? Oh, there's a windmill down there. I didn't see that before. It's think about this. Is she going to be able to make this jump? Thankfully, there's a... Oh. Maybe if she goes down, because isn't there a... Oh, no. We can help her make jumps, too. That's cute. Okay. I was thinking that was, like, a ledge down there that she could just, like, jump down to, and then we could help her up the other side or whatever, but this works. Really use a bit of maintenance on this uh, here castle, couldn't they? So then we bring the box around. We get her, help her onto the box. And then, what, send the box back up again? Or back over to wherever it was? Does the game let us do that? Move it twice? If we can just climb up and down that chain. get down to wherever it originally was but before I go through like moving over there bring her on it and all that can we move it again we can okay good 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 and we can even skip the little cutscene uh, I think this will be faster maybe just please don't die God, but doing it this way, I have to not miss the jump. Maybe we should have just did it the other way. 
We've already missed this jump once. Us and this jump don't get along. Triangle to jump, okay. Oh, thank fuck, okay. Whatever you do, don't drop her now. Oh, good. She can just make that jump on her own. Even better. Now do I trust myself to make this jump? Okay. That scared me. I'm not going to lie. It's, I mean, it doesn't even look like a hard jump. But I didn't think it would be a hard jump the first time whenever I fucking died either. Now move it back. From whence it came, but hopefully she doesn't fall. Nope, she's fine. I would suggest maybe like sitting down or something when the vehicle is in motion, but each their own, I guess. Whatever works, dude. Uh, this is a little scary. Oh, just walk. Okay. Oh, we Gucci. Everything is fine. Doodle, thank you so much for the five bits, love. Now what, though? Jump to there. That's a big-ass jump. Please don't fuck it up. Okay. She can make this. With our help, she can make this. Just trust us. I know we only just met a few minutes ago, but trust us. Fuck, dude, that scares the shit out of me every time. <laughs> this girl really has too much faith in us. Look at that, or, I don't know, maybe she's technically immortal or something. She just doesn't have to worry about it. Death don't scare her. Yes, save, please. For the love of fuck, save. Trolley too. That was the name of it, a trolley. I guess they are like a. Aren't, are they a European developer? Ja Japanese, Japanese developer actually. Do they call it trolleys. Whatever their word for trolley is. I would think minecart. That's a that's a pretty box you got there, game. Are these actual bombs? Can I take stuff between rooms? I can. Oh, that scared me. When, oh, that's a pit. I was like, is it gonna blow up? No, it seems fine. I, hold on. Is there any point? There's another side to all this. Oh, there's a door for her. But how do we get her over there? I guess that's the puzzle. There was another path to take. That's why I left her up there, because I wasn't sure which path was the right one anyways. The bombs seem to respawn, so maybe those will be important in some way? Especially with, like, the way we can throw them. Uh, okay, she's over there. It's like, dude, where did she go? Oh, I'm sorry, love. Just charge your phone while you're downstairs. That way you don't have to worry about it tonight. And then I'll try to remember to uh, plug it in tomorrow for you. Okay, so there's another way for me to get down there. We should probably bring her with us. Each that. Can't seem to, like, jump sideways. We can only jump up. Just 
about done anyways, so I don't think it's worth going back to pick her up. Oh, shit, fuck. Oh, we're alive. Okay. So if we do go up here... Yeah, we can go over to that chandelier. Is this where we came in at? No, we came in over there, right? What is this door? Game suddenly opened up a lot. It's giving me a lot of options. Is this another loading screen or did we get too far away? We got too far away. She's dead. Okay. So that's, that's another good thing to know for whenever we eventually actually play play the game. Is that if we get too far away, she also dies. Good to know. Good to know. Oh, fuck. Well, it is 2.30, guys. I do think that's going to be it there. But uh, I'm down to play completely. So I'm going to put it on the list. I'm very curious lore-wise what the game's like, you know? And I do like the puzzles. I just hope we don't get stuck on another simple but uh, <laughs> jank puzzle like we got stuck on for 50 minutes not too long ago. <laughs> that would be annoying. But I'm sure that won't happen again, right? Anyways, yeah. Boy's gonna get some sleep. We'll be playing Final Fantasy X tomorrow. That's exciting. We're slowly making our way through that game. Uh, I'm not sure how much longer we have. I'm guessing we're about halfway through the game, give or take. Maybe a little bit farther. Hard to say, really. Um, but yeah, so we'll be playing that tomorrow. I hope to see whoever can be there there. And uh, that's it. Good night. Uh, be kind to each other and see you next time. Bye, y'all. Suzerain status lost. Imagine that. I wonder who took my Suzerain status again. I don't know, man. Yeah, I'm sure you don't.